Champ. Look at this. Look at this. We're not in the gym. We're actually very, very far from the gym. We have been invited to the Boys and Girls Club out here to do some fitness with some awesome kiddos and everything. Um, the funny thing is, is I got this email for this opportunity, this amazing opportunity I'm super excited for, right after I created the baby reels. <laughs> That's a true story. And I was like, do you guys not know what, who you just asked to appear at the Boys and Girls Club? Anyway, I was telling Matt last night, I was like, this is going to be such a cool opportunity. So, so cool, unique, different, and obviously getting involved in so many different ways with the community is something um, super special and what we want to do more of. But I was like, I'm scared. Like, kids are ruthless. You should be scared. Like, I'm scared. Just, like you know it. <laughs> yeah. You know it. I'm scared. So, um, <laughs> yeah, you heard this guy say they're mom. But it's going to be a good time. So, we're with uh, the CrossFit, some of the CrossFit seminar staff, the red shirts. Um, we're going to go walk in and see what's going on today. I think we're going to do a little bit of a, a workout, a um, little bit of meet and greet with a, a couple other games athletes that are here. Um, so, we're in for a a good interesting day with the kiddos. I should have brought the baby doll though. So I should mm. prove to them how good I am with kids. Alright. <laughs> Let's go do it. I'm about to say, you ready to show those skills? You ready to show those skills, bro? <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. We were just talking about this, so um, I have a plan. I'm right now. I'm just creating a a list of things I'm gonna do when my competitive career is over. I know, I know you're supposed to live life and like do things, not not have to wait and everything. But I already put. What's up? No, you're good. You're good. Yeah. I was just talking about how I want to do aerial yoga. Say it again. <laughs> aerial, yoga. <laughs> aerial yoga. So we're, many things. We're and on skateboarding. Topic. I see we're on topic. Yes. <laughs> oh. Drowning in the lost emotion. Crying like some kind of ocean from my eyes. But I got a out of the hopeless. Yeah, I got over you last night.
Hey, what y'all think? What y'all think? You have fun? Yeah. 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 Good yeah. yeah. we'll workout. Good we'll workout. How you feeling? You feeling good? <laughs> oh, you heard your own? Let me get Gerard to get it. What about me? Y'all ready? Yep, bring it on my team. Y'all want to take a picture? I saw you uh, had a few like really good interactions with a lot of kids. You know? Oh man, did I? So as a dad, yeah. like I got a six year old, I got a four year old. They're like, hey, can you take the young kids? I was like, those are the ones I want to hang out with, right? Like yeah. those, that, that's what I'm used to because I've coached my own youth sports teams. Yeah. I've been on seminar staff. I've been a coach. I've owned an affiliate for a decade. And to be able to bring CrossFit to these kids for the first time is always a unique experience. Like there's, a, there's one thing to give it to a bunch of adults, but I say adults are a bit tougher to get on board. And like it didn't matter what it was, like these kids were all in. So it was super fun to bring that to them, get them all together and just competing in a way that they're probably not used to or accustomed to, uh, accustomed from, but uh, man, it was a great experience to have, to bring this to them. This is like the first time. Awesome. I loved it, man. This, those are good kids. Yeah, they're great kids. The best moment was handing out the little awards after, and one was the like most effort given, and one of the kids, while they were explaining the award, was like tugged on my shirt, he's like, hey, I worked really hard. I was like, I know you did. Like, we're all working hard, but that's who they picked. So at the moment where he was trying to recognize himself, yeah. we recognized him at the same time, yeah. which to me is that CrossFit moments are very serendipitous to me, yes. where they just, yes. everything kind of comes together and to see that micro moment yeah, in person at real time, that was probably the, the coolest that's moment of the day. That was pretty cool. Yeah, that was awesome. Really man, I'm too local not to come back to you. Go, you do it, you do it. Yeah, dude, you should do it more often. Do it a lot. You should do it a lot. Yeah, it's yeah. great. Yeah. It's great. I mean, <laughs> to be able to influence these kids in a positive way of maybe something they don't get on a daily basis, yeah, I think yeah, it's really yeah. important. I know, yeah. To be in a position to help them with that and give that to them. And to be in a position to, to do that, I think it's important to take advantage of those moments. Because, I mean, shoot, we all remember when we were kids. I mean, the things you remember when you were five or six, still to this day, negative. But if you can make that a positive thing, like I remember the positive things just as much. If we can bring that to them that they might not get or have an opportunity to have, I think it's very important. I think one of the coolest things is remembering the impact that people had on you, the type of people that were there. Yeah. Because right? you still remember those people from when you were a kid. Exactly. Yeah. Like, by name, face, and you may have only met them a handful of times, but... And that's where the... To me... It's... Not to say scary in a sense, but you don't truly understand the impact you can have on someone because it's their experience, mm -hmm. not yours. And what they take away from the experience you gave them is totally in the own world of which it's presented to them. And so to understand the power you have, both positive and potentially negative, sometimes that's a little scary. Yeah. But today, man, it was a great day. Really great day. It was awesome. Yeah. yeah. It's CrossFit, man. That's what it's all about. Yeah. That's, why it's, that's why it's the best. It was a yeah. blast. Thank you. It's not just a workout. Yeah, it's not just a workout at all. It's like the lowest part of the whole thing. And everything above that is like crosses the foundation and everything above that. That's that's the important thing. The things that people keep coming back to the affiliates, friendships they make, relationships they make. It's all in that yeah. foundation of CrossFit. So which if we can bring more of that around, I mean, it's just making everything a better place. Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Don't look so excited though. Action. Red lights on. Let's go. Oh my gosh. How did we end up back here? <laughs> Teleportation. Do y'all remember this place where everything is done? Oh, uh, we wrapped up that event. That was super cool. Super, super cool. Something very new for us and just something Matt and I have talked about a lot just over the... Hey, we're trying to talk here. And Blitz Blitz is here. Of course he's happy we're back. You're coming next time, buddy. But we've talked about it in the past of just trying 
to find ways to get involved in, and not necessarily involved but we love this so much obviously like we we live this life and it's it's changed our lives and made us like love life in so many different ways and dealing with people and people that need to build confidence and need to get themselves healthy and everything and now there's the fact that today we got to work with kiddos that can hopefully maybe like even if it was just one kiddo today to like set themselves up for a healthier stronger lifestyle i mean that's that's what it's all about like we love to train hard you guys get to see all that we love to compete hard you guys get to see all that but this this is crossfit what we did today and it, it really is something special and something i want to do more um i feel like we do a little bit of everything in here and that that's the coolest part of uh this sport what we do and this this community if you guys are, are watching this like realize if if you're in this community i really do think it's something special and if you can even though they make fun of us for talking about CrossFit all the time, they're like, Cross, there's always memes everywhere, right? CrossFitters like to talk about CrossFit all the time. Because it really is a powerful thing. It's not even just the physical side of it. It's being able to change your mindset on life. And hopefully, maybe we inspired some kiddos to take care of themselves. And I heard, we heard some pretty cool things of like CrossFit trying to do, make create some different outlets for, for some people. Um, whether it's in sports, physical fitness, or like maybe making, maybe becoming a coach one day. So it was a lot of fun. I only got hit in the face like a couple times playing dodgeball. <laughs> I hope you caught one of those. Like there were balls flying everywhere. Um, but this is where our home and we're back at it. We're back to all the stuff. Hey, do you want to say something to the vlog at all? I mean, he, I didn't know he was going to be pulled into all of the yeah. craziness, but just you just jumped right you in. ran one of the groups and everything. Um, did a lot of fun just coaching and staying engaged and trying to teach the kids how to squat. And most importantly, I think the cool thing about today was uh, learning, trying to share the experience that fitness can be fun and it's fun to work hard and breathe hard and move your body and with a big group of people and uh so we did we did a lot of that and it was it was fun hey i'll say some, to... something else i want to say something else because i actually have a legit question for both of you guys if i wear a t-shirt i look puny right if i wear a t-shirt yeah, but yeah. i wore my tank top for a, or wore a tank top for a reason day sun's out guns out but of course the, t the talk of everything was like, how do you, all the kiddos are like, how do you get so strong? They're like asking me to flex and everything. And I'm like, hey, you gotta do your push-ups. We gotta learn how to do push-ups. We gotta learn how to do this stuff. And then you can get strong. And of course they're like, how much can you lift? And it's really, it's funny in a way, but also when you get to be you and like be proud of like, yes, I'm, I'm really small, but I can lift big weights and, and hopefully inspire these kids to do their push-ups and keep themselves healthier and everything. Cause I was like laughing every time they asked me to flex, but they were like, man, I want muscles like that. So just, just, I encourage anyone out there to just like realize the power you have to just walk in front of them and change someone's mindset or the, the little things that you say to people like can affect someone so big and especially the little kids they're so same with one, the teenagers one looking little, at them, looking them at, thing, looking at them in the eye perspective giving them encouragement telling them they can do it encouraging them to you know challenge themselves in a different way and they, I mean if you do if you're genuine in it, they, people sense that and it does make a difference. And you don't know. I think that's one of the coolest things. I, I think like working with young kids like that is just in when we CrossFit, it's such a, or just any sort of like physical fitness, there's just a very um, clean correlation between if I put in the work and I work hard, I will get a result. And sometimes you might not always see that in other places in life, but if I come in here and I do push ups, for a couple weeks, I see my push-ups getting better. If I squat, I see my squats numbers going up or my squats getting better. Like, it's a very clear, so um, I think that's a cool, powerful moment or tool or learning moment for kids is like, wow, I can have some agency over my life and the world when I work, work yeah. for it. So, it's cool. Yeah. So, it was cool to share what we do in a different light today and then hope maybe we inspired maybe a, yeah. a couple kiddos today and help them out 
So, very cool. Something a little bit different for our squad today. And Thanks Briggs, for the invite, CrossFit. Yes, thank you, CrossFit. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Gerard, thanks for coming with us. Thanks for getting, he got right gonna in ask, the middle of the gonna floor. What were you going to ask Gerard? You said you had ask me question. what? You said you had a question. No, it was for, it was the t-shirt question. It was oh, like, okay. do I, because I feel oh. so small when I wear t-shirts and I knew if I went in my tank top today, like I wanted to be about our lifestyle and everything. And it was, it was funny in a way, but it was also like a proud moment of trying to inspire people like it's it's cool to be strong and it's 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 cool to be who you are and just own it a, li a little bit and i don't know it was it was cool thank you for getting right in the firing zone for dodgeball for the yeah. shot did it for yeah. the shot <laughs> no, nobody hit me so we were good <laughs> I was hoping they would though. I was hoping somebody would throw it right at the camera. That would so make a cool, this, yeah. that made a cool shot. Blitz, you got to do your work too. You weren't invited to this one, but we're going to make sure you get invited next time. Okay, bud? All right, guys. Fun times. On Peace. to more cool stuff. See you guys later. Later.